What's up, you guys? This is Karmic Endings, TNT, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of. Or <clears throat> this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangels, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current karmic energy for the collective. Please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate you. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support. All right, so let's get into it. See what's going on with the collective. Right, let's see. Chaser. Stuck and stagnant. So somebody could be feeling like they stuck and stagnant with somebody that's angry all the time. That's on their ass. Somebody could feel stuck in this situation. And there could be friends on social media stalking you. Okay? So there could be... For some of y'all, this could have something to do with an ex. For some of y'all. This person could be stuck with somebody that is on their ass chasing them. And they could be stuck with somebody that they that's angry all the time. And for some of y'all, this angry person could have friends that's watching you. Or whoever this whoever this angry person is chasing... Friends could be uh, watching you as well. So you could have a lot of people, friends watching you, okay? <laughs> All right, for some of y'all, this could have something to do. Somebody could be chasing somebody and mad, okay? Like somebody is on somebody's ass is what I'm seeing. All right, so let's see. Let's get into it, spirit. What's going on with this energy? All right, let's see. What's going on, Spirit, with this energy, please? Clear and accurate messages. What's going on with this energy? Uh-oh, let's see. That's not supposed to be in there. All right, what's going on with this energy? Knight of Cups. Okay, so for some of y'all, this could be somebody you went out on a date on. This could be what's coming towards you, or this could be somebody you did went out on recently. Somebody could have a Scorpio moon, or this could have something to do with a Scorpio for some of y'all. All right, so for some of y'all, you went out on a date with somebody, and this person could have like a baby mama or ex on their ass or something like that that they're not telling you about. All right, devil car, hell yeah. <laughs> somebody in some kind of contract with somebody justice the moon or for some of y'all this could be what's coming towards you all right so this could be what's you know like coming towards you all right somebody somebody wants to make you some kind of proposal and some kind of contract but somebody don't want somebody is trying to keep you from getting this they're trying to keep they're trying to keep you from getting this for real. Yeah, they're trying to keep somebody in a stalemate. Yeah, and and scared to make a decision. Yeah, if somebody is trying to keep somebody stuck and trying and trying to keep somebody from like making a decision. So somebody could be trying to put fear in somebody um so they won't make a decision. 3 of wands. So somebody could be um Putting negative thoughts in like somebody's head about their future and stuff like that. And, and how somebody will make them look or something like that. So somebody could be putting like bad thoughts in somebody's head about somebody. Okay. Something to do with a Scorpio, Capricorn, Libra, Pisces, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay. We have strong Libra out here. Okay. Somebody could have a Libra moon. All right, Sagittarius moon, Scorpio moon. Okay, let's see. All right, Spirit. What's this Knight of Cups? What's this Knight of Cups for this energy? I'm telling you. 
There's a lot of chaos and conflict when it comes to this, this offer that somebody is trying to keep somebody from getting. Exactly. But you're going to get it anyway. Knight of Cups. You're going to get it. It's in your destiny to get this. Yeah. Okay. Because God said so. <laughs> so somebody is trying to fight something that you're going to get anyway. Something to do with a Leo or a Scorpio. Okay. Clarify the devil. Clarify the devil. King of Pentacles. Exactly. Seven of Pentacles. So it's and it's already written written that this contract with this King of Pentacles. So whoever this person is that's hell bent on trying to keep somebody from getting it, it's not gonna work. Yeah, five of swords. This listen, this queen of uh pentacles here is working non-stop. This this motherfucker ain't stopping for real. Okay, this person is just they keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. This is like damn. <laughs> Clarify justice. Clarify justice. Somebody is trying to keep somebody in a contract. Two of Pentacles. But somebody could be realizing like some truth in a situation or somebody could be realizing something that what they did or something like that. So somebody could owe a contract. That's also what I'm hearing. I'm hearing like somebody could owe a contract and they're trying to keep from like paying the contract or something like that. Or this person could be trying to get out of something with the contract. Okay. Like somebody could have signed a contract. And this person could be trying to get out of it some kind of way. All right. That's also what I'm getting like on a sneak tip. But this person could feel stuck and stagnant because it's like this person is not able to get out of the contract until this person give what they owe. So it's like this person is trying to get their get out of the contract. But this person, they can't get out of nothing until they pay what they owe or something like that. But this person could be trying to find a way to get out of the contract though. Okay. Yep. Clarify the moon. But this person is scared though. Somebody is scared on, on getting out of a contract. Yep, death card. Because somebody know that I mean <laughs> that this is what they are risking. You know what I'm saying? Somebody know that they you know they risking something or this person is trying to avoid this. But this person is taking a risk and trusting that they are go that they're gonna be okay. Okay, I'm hearing like somebody could be like, I'm hearing just somebody is just gonna play their role in a situation. Like somebody could be like, um, getting a plan together on how they gonna strategically move in a situation. So somebody is trying to you know strategically moving this because in this situation that some that somebody is like trying to get out of this shit it's like they have to strategically move like somebody have to move very very strategically in order to get out of something yeah because listen whoever this person is in this contract with they on their ass something to do with aquarius somebody is on somebody ass for real Clarify two of swords. Clarify two of swords. Yep, ten of wands. Page of wands. I mean, it's really hard. Somebody, the reason why somebody could be in a stalemate is is because it's like so much on somebody. Like somebody got a lot on their plate when it comes to their career. It's like they have a lot on them. And somebody is trying to keep the peace right now because it's like it's like this person could be saying, I can't handle no much no more pressure right now. I'm trying to deal with one thing at a time. Like that's what somebody could be saying. So it's like somebody trying to keep the peace until like some other things die down in their situation. Because somebody could have like a lot on their plate. Alright. Clarify nine of wands. Oh, 
Uh, let's see. What, what was that? The Ten of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands. Somebody is like moving forward. Somebody is going forward. Somebody been going through this for a while though. Somebody been going through this shit for a while with somebody. But somebody is persevering. They're not, you know, they're not giving up. But they've been going through this for a while. Okay. Even I'm hearing this karmic, whoever this karmic energy is, that somebody could be leaving. This person could be on somebody's ass. This person could have friends that's watching, watching y'all and shit. Okay. Yep, this person could have like they friends watching. Clarify nine of wands. Clarify nine of wands. Get the card on top. Seven of wands. I'm telling you. Somebody is whoever this person is, they, they keep going forward though. Yeah, even though nine of swords, somebody could be really in their head about everything that's going on. Because somebody could have had a betrayal that they didn't see coming in this in this contract that they had with their family. Like, yeah. And somebody could be really in some kind of huge lack. But this person want to come together with you even though they're going to be in this lack. But the tables is turned and you taking this passion and new beginning that's within your destiny. Okay? You're taking this passion and new beginning that's within your destiny. So for some of you guys, this is just an energy where this is a karmic energy. This this could have been a divine counterpart at a, one point in time for some of y'all. But this person is dealing with their karma. It's like they chose something over you that they trying to get away from to come to you to save them. But they chose this person over you though. But now it's like, I want to get away from this person. Now, I, I can't get wait to get away from this person. I want to get away. But it's like, no, you got to sit in that shit. That's what you was fighting so hard to be with. So there you go. You know what I'm saying? Like, you fought so hard. What, what they say? You fought for your limitations. So you got to keep them. You know what I'm saying? You you wanted that energy. You got that energy. And now you trying to get away from the energy. <laughs> It's like, what the fuck? Current energy? Let's see, what's this? Yeah, this main female. Somebody is trying to get away from this woman. Here. <laughs> Somebody is trying to get away from this woman, yo. This is a lie. Current energy. Give me one more spirit. I'm... Listen. Main female poverty. Somebody, this main female is trying to keep this person stuck because this person know that they're going to be in poverty. So somebody is hell bent on trying to keep somebody stuck. Okay. Through court. Okay. So somebody could be trying to deplete somebody through court trying, you know what I'm saying? I mean, but hey, I mean, if this person, I mean, they didn't listen to the downloads that they got before of not getting with this person so now they gotta suffer the consequences so i mean if somebody end up winning in court and somebody take a huge lack i mean that's just a karmic lesson that somebody is learning sometimes karmic lessons you do go through like huge lacks and stuff like that i mean that's sometimes it takes that in order for you to learn Sometimes it takes to have to go through those extremes for you to say, oh, okay. And there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? Because shit, I've had situations with me where shit, I had to have a soft ass. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm just keeping it 110. I had to hard head made my ass soft. You know what I'm saying? And I had to make it do what it do. And I learned. Okay. But this person is going through that situation. Okay, they're going through the situation right now about them, you know, constantly they this person chose something that now they're regretting. And this person could be hell bent on trying to get out of something, but it's like Nick motherfucker, that's your karma, nigga. Motherfucker, that's your karma. <laughs> that's your motherfucker karma. 
You got to deal with that. Yeah, somebody can have a lip piercing. Okay. Something with 39 or 37. Something with November 15th, November 18th, February 2nd, February 15th, February 11th, February 18th. Somebody could have an 11-year-old, a 15-year-old, an 18-year-old. Somebody could be a construction worker. Something about the mountains as well. All right. Somebody kid, uh, I'm seeing something about a scientific project. <laughs> like somebody kid could have had something about a scientific project. Something to do with a Capricorn or a Libra. Something about a scientific project. <laughs> I'm seeing that. Okay. Yeah. So it's like for some of y'all, this could be somebody that want to come towards you. It is for and for others, this is somebody you already you already went out on a date on. And if this is a person you already went out on a date on, they could have somebody that's on their ass that's don't want them to leave and shit. And for some of y'all, you could be about to find out that this person you know, they got a crazy-ass motherfucker on their tail for some of y'all. This person that you went out on a date on. This person could be a Leo or a Scorpio. Okay? But, yeah. Or a Sagittarius. Okay? Libra or a Pisces. Yeah, you're going to figure out that this person got a crazy-ass person hooked up to them. Okay? Hell yeah. Mm-hmm. Somebody could be like afraid. So whoever this person is that's chasing somebody, I mean somebody could have a little fear in their heart when it comes to this person because this person could be really crazy or something. And that's how somebody could feel. That somebody is like really crazy. <laughs> so something like that. Okay. But this main female, for some of y'all, this main female could be in poverty right now. Or this person could be afraid of going into poverty. Because the person that they're attached to is like, you know, it's a lot to that. You know, it's a lot to it. Somebody could have like long, wavy, dark hair. This could be like a wig or something like that. Or this could be somebody real hair. Like it's long and like wavy and dark. Okay. Current energy for the collective. Current energy for the collective. Current energy for the collective. This person that's getting chased could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or a Leo or a Sagittarius, Scorpio. That could be the person getting chased. Current energy. Bottom of the deck. Married. Somebody can have short hair waves. Current energy. Somebody could be an ex con as well. So somebody could be like an ex-con or something like that. Vietnamese, Chinese, Japanese, and or Korean. Somebody could be an actress or an actor. That air sign of hater, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have fast food. Manager. Somebody could have thin lips. We have tea. Love and or romantic movies. Rap artist, we have in braids or locks, a fake ass emperor, black socks, white liquor, clear liquor, sedan, high class, X. Somebody can have dark eyes, colorful nails, five, five to six feet, sex industry. Something to do with a Virgo could be significant. We have D, colorful hair. Leo, 
long straight hair, real or fake, left leg and our thigh tattoos. We have P, dimples, somebody love wearing buns in their hair, trainer or trainee, lip piercing, braces. We have Libra. All right. I heard Tania, Tamaya, Tania, something to do with Texas or Tennessee. Somebody could have been born in September. Somebody could have a nine-year-old. Somebody could be nine weeks pregnant, nine months pregnant. Somebody could have a nine-week-old, I'm hearing as well. I heard Dexter. Dexter. I heard Naomi. I heard Nancy. I heard Nelly. I heard Nefertiti or Nephi. I heard Dante, Dominique, De Dion, Deanna, Dwayne, Demarcus, Mario, Marcus, Mauricio, Tevin. Something with Xavier. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. I really hope this helped you of uh, some shape or form. But this crazy ass person, they got friends watching you too. So this per this crazy person that somebody that this person this crazy person is chasing somebody. This crazy person friends is watching you. All right, they watching you, paying attention like somebody just motherfucking crazy. Because, I mean, this main female, like I said, they could be in poverty or this person could be on their way in poverty. And they just mad as fuck, okay, about this. They mad as fuck. Yep. So, basically, this karmic friends is watching you and all this other shit because this karmic is going in poverty and this karmic friends is like, what the fuck? <laughs> All right. For some of y'all, these, these comic friends could be like looking at you kind of like sideways because it's like you keep persevering in your situation. You not giving up. You not having like any lack. Somebody could have a Leo, a uh, Saturn or Uranus. Or somebody could have a very powerful. Yeah, somebody is very like powerful or something like that. It's like you don't give you don't give up. You don't. You don't let down. You know what I'm saying? You keep going. Teddy. Something with Teddy or Ted. Alright, you guys. I really hope this helped you. Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And this uh, main female. This person could have a little girl. Uh, this person also could be uh, getting some child support as well. Yep, somebody could be like getting some child support. Yep, when it comes to this wealthy man. Yep, this person is focusing on trying to get this child support. All right, and that's just period. <laughs> All right, you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.